<laughs> hey, I'm gonna ask some people. So I just took it off, and the okay. So the problem with this thing is it kept slipping on me. So this the lip and this is a lip mask from the last video um how i feel about it um it just kept slipping and that was really my own like like and the texture was kind of weird but i'm gonna take the access and kind of rub it on my lips taking the access rubbing it all over my lips so i can just kind of moisturize it All right, so now that we're done. Yeah, so my thoughts on the lip mask. Um, the jelly, the jelly part, I feel like it wasn't sticking very well. So if you guys gotta watch the first video before you watch this one to see me putting it on. But it just wasn't sticking very well. I had to hold it the whole time, which made it very dry in the front. Um, kind of trying to rub all the access off. Come on, we gotta get our two dollars and fifty cents use. See, I'm gonna show you guys. I'm gonna stick it on. Oh, see, the littlest thing that I do will make it fall. I was showing you guys how it was like sticking up, but I'm going to cut it to see the jelly formula on the inside. So I started out this video talking to you guys like you were one of my, like, you guys are my friends. But I mean like one of my friends on like a FaceTime, I was like, so the thing is, it kept slipping. <laughs> but you gotta watch the first video to really understand. So I'm gonna cut right on the lip outline. Cause you know, why not? Because it's not reusable. So why not just do a little choppy choppy? Especially it's jelly, so it's gonna cut so nicely. All right, we're all cut. And now I'm gonna try to place them on their separate pieces on my lips. So here we are, guys. first piece see if I like lean my head down I had to keep my head up the whole time so my thoughts on this like I was saying were I mean it's would I buy one again probably not but i mean for people with bigger lips it might take up like more lip room but i don't really have big lips so it didn't really take up much room i mean like it was like too big so it definitely wasn't fit for my lips but would i buy it again oh no probably not but like i said if people with bigger lips had it it would probably work better for them but didn't work 100 percent well for me so i'm gonna give you guys a quick update on what happened um yesterday with the maybelline fit me foundation i didn't do any updates i apologize but it was very well it didn't even look like i had applied makeup like a face makeup foundation it looked like my normal skin but my freckles that I have covered up my acne covered up it just kind of looked so natural that I was like is this real for six dollars like it was so drastically nice I just loved it but I'm gonna show you guys like the application I'm gonna apply a little bit onto my wrist so that you guys can see like the blending format how like nice it can blend and i feel like it's just so well put together for its price i just freaking love it 
like six dollars like this is like i feel like i bought some dior <laughs> it's like it's I, I just love it i'm now in love with the maybelline fit me foundation all right i just kind of took the access out of the cap just to kind of show you guys here but so it just looks so natural that it's out of this world so let me show you guys let me put this back so i'm gonna show you guys you can't really see it but it is so nicely blended it doesn't even look like it's there just so perfect but thank you guys for watching so different lip masks might do different things but this one just didn't really work for me i mean i'll let you guys know tomorrow morning maybe if my lips feel more hydrated i feel like they're looking bigger for some reason but if they feel more hydrated and things i'll let you guys know but if they don't i won't let you guys know because then you'll know oh it didn't really work for her. i'm not gonna buy it but peace out, my awesome people. Bye.